ideas we have discussed everything about molality if you haven't watched that video you can click this link and go through that this question was given at the end of that video for you to try hope you might have tried that let's check what is the answer and how to solve this one read the question the molality of urea solution in which 0.1 gram of urea is added to 0.3 dm cube of water at stp will be whatever it may be they are telling you to calculate the molality of the solution right first of all write what is molality of a solution see to calculate molality of the solution we need number of moles of the solute also as well as mass of the solvent also how can you calculate the number of moles of the solute for that they have given the mass of the solute mass of urea is 0.01 gram they are telling how to calculate number of moles yeah. we have a shortcut formula right yeah number of moles is equal to given mass divided by molar mass what's the given mass of the solute or urea that will be equal to 0.01 gram we will write divided by how can you calculate the molar mass of urea we know that yeah. molar mass of nitrogen will be equal to 14 gram per mole agreed yeah. and that of carbon will be 12 gram per mole hydrogen 1 gram per mole and what about oxygen that will be equal to 16 gram per mole see they have already given the molecular formula add all this together you will be getting the molecular mass as 60 gram per mole you can check it it is correct only okay gram gram will be cancel you will be getting the number of mole as 1.66 into 10 raised to minus 4 mole Okay. Yes. So we got the number of moles already. Now we need the mass of the solvent. They haven't given that in the problem. Instead of that, they have given the volume of water. If you know the volume of water, is it possible to calculate the mass of the solvent? Yes. Okay. We know that density of water will be equal to mass divided by volume. If so, mass will be equal to density into volume. Okay. So what will be the density of water? Yeah, we can say that it is thousand gram per liter or dm cube. We will write it's a constant actually for water. Okay, yeah. So we are substituting that thousand yeah. gram per liter or dm cube into what will be the volume given? That is zero point three zero 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 dm cube. okay yeah so this dm cube dm cube will be cancelling and you will be getting the answer as 300 g that will be the mass of water okay so mass of solvent also we got it already now substitute here number of moles of the solute will be equal to 1.66 into 10 raised to minus 4 moles okay divided by mass of the solvent should be in kilogram so we are dividing this 300 g by 1000 okay so you will be getting the answer as 0.300 kg okay calculate this one you will be getting the answer as 5.53 into 10 raised to minus 4 molal agreed yes so the answer is more closely to a okay so that will be the correct option hope you also might have got the correct answer okay great